Hey there, Chad Boninger here for Ohio University Libraries. Some of my business students are working on analyzing the overall healthcare market in the nation and also in Southeast Ohio. This video shows you how to use MRI to get demographics of people who attend doctors regularly or who attend or who visit specific kinds of doctors as well. So uh, using MRI can get you very, very good detailed information for the national market, which you can then apply to your local market by comparing it with like census demographic, demographic information, things like that. So this video shows you how to use MRI to get that information. So here you go. So MRI, once you get here, is a database that requires you to create a login with them. So if you try to use your Ohio email address and Ohio password without first registering with them, it won't work. So you want to do that first. So what we're going to do is actually click on uh, uh, register for free here, and that's where you go and create your account. I've already done that, so I'm going to log in as me here, and I'll just click log in. And uh, it's going to take us to a page here. Um, I encourage you to ignore all the content here except for this one little link to MediaMark Reporter. So we're going to click right there. And that's actually going to open a new tab and take us to the actual database where we actually accept their terms and conditions. So we're going to click accept there. It's going to take you to a funny page that looks like this. Uh, generally what you'll do is click on the fall 2011 product and click there. And you can see there's all kinds of categories that you can choose from. Now what we can do is go in and just search for like, oh, let's just search for doctor, just for uh, uh, for looking at the healthcare market. Let's click for, uh, search for doctor here. And so here we have, um, uh, there is a personal care doctor's visit section here. And you can see what you find here is demographics for people, for example, uh, for, let's say for someone who's visited a gastroenterologist in the last 12 months, this gives you demographics of those folks, okay? So what you're going to do is you're actually going to ignore this first column. This is the total adult population. What we're interested in is this column here. So according to this, um, of f basically what this says is of the total adult population of 230 million people in the U.S., 8.9 million of them have visited the doctor in the last, or the gastroenterologist in the past 12 months which is 3.9% of the total population. And if you go down, you can, you can see, uh, for example, here is another category here, the age 55 to 64. Uh, there are 2 million uh, um, people aged 55 to 64 who visit a gastroenterologist in the last 12 months. That is 22.4% of the total who have visited. So that's between this and your 65 plus, those are basically your biggest users or, or, or folks who visited the gastroenterologist more often. So that, that makes pretty good sense. You know, older people are going to probably go to the doctor uh, more often. So uh, you can see this is under the personal care section. So if you want to find other information like that, you can click on new database here and click on 2011 product and then go into the personal care section. Just click there. Then that gives you all kinds of stuff in here where you can see uh, who uses personal care services, for example, uh, who has had LASIK eye surgery, uh, doctor visits, and, you know, you see there's all kinds of things in here that talk about doctor visits and things like that. So a good way to kind of get general um, uh, uh, demographic data of folks who, um, who have, have, have see doctors more frequently and things like that. So here you're, here's your people who visit a doctor six plus times in the last um, 12 months and again we're probably going to be looking at um, you know typically your your older population uh, there now what you can do is basically take this information this is at a national level and combine it with what you know about your local market via uh, census or other other county profiles and things like that so here we have like household income uh, things like that so um, you might be able uh, to, to notice a pattern in, in who attends uh, or who visits doctors more frequently based on their household income or even based on you know, whether they have children or not, obviously, um, so, or uh, things like that. So uh, age level, things like that. So it might be a good way to kind of better understand the demographics of those people who are going to attend or going to visit uh, doctors uh, more frequently or sp uh, particular ty types of doctors, chiropractor, cardiologist, uh, dermatologist, things like that. So a great way to kind of get uh, quick information on your uh, on your market. Uh, there's a sp you can download this to a spreadsheet so you can have the data in, in Excel and manipulate it however you want to uh, that way. So that's how you'd use MRI to better understand uh, the healthcare market in general. Hopefully this video helped you understand how to use MediaMark Reporter to understand general demographics uh, and national trends of your product or service area. 
Should you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. I'll be glad to help you any way I can. Take care and have a great day.